that October was ridiculously warm. And Steve Spangler is joining us now because we're talking about a couple of things that come with the fact that when we roll into November and December, many of us just assume the brown cloud comes back. But this also has to do with the time change. Yeah, buddy. A lot of people are talking, you know, normally it's just it's daylight savings and people are, all right, I guess you put your clock Extra back. Extra sleep. Yeah, be. boom, boom, boom. But there's more and more discussion now about the science of daylight savings. And you know, a long time ago, uh, Scott Yates, who was a contributor here at Nine News for many years with my traffic, um, uh, put a, a wonderful article out uh, at CNN a about the time change and about yeah. kind of the thought of people not doing that anymore. You know, the history of it, a little, right. people thought that it was because of farming, because they could spend right. a little bit more time uh, farming. Uh, but really from an environmental standpoint, this is a wonderful demonstration. So if you're a teacher or you want to set up the things tonight, because who doesn't like brightly colored liquids in the kitchen, especially if there's a white carpet that's just, just couple feet They're away. Just it's begging perfect. to perfect. be a part of this. <laughs> so, so here's the setup. These are just juice bottles. Uh, the viewers will see that I put little notes on the front. So feel them. Uh, this is cold. Cold. Mm -hmm. Got it. Feel this one here. Hot. Mm -hmm. That's super hot. Okay. But uh, there's hot. No. So here's what we're okay. going to do. These juice bottles, of course, I took the labels off and excuse the reach. I'm going to fill it to the very top. Very, now, very the hard top. part okay. is this, Kim, you can't bump the table. All right. Okay. So there's this one and this guy is sitting over here. Prediction time. You ready? Mm -hmm. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the playing card. It'll seem like a magic trick. It's not. Just going to take the playing card, put it on top here, turn this bottle upside down, put it on top of this bottle, and then I'm going to ask you what's going to happen when I pull the card away. Oh my Got gosh. It? Okay, really? Right, there you go. Cold here. Cold Hot here. Turn it upside down. Beautiful. <laughs> this is over the top. And not make a mess. All right, here you go. The prediction right. is you make a mess, but no, that's what's, okay. What's the prediction? Um, so it's going to be the inversion. It's gonna, what does that mean? Are you that just means the, the, term? the dark colors go. That's when you see that dark cloud yes, hanging yes. over so, the so city. So will the blue so stay here and the yellow stay here, or are they going to mix up? They're going to mix up, but the, nice, yeah. Nice the, job. That's, Let's check yeah. and see. Let's check and see how well she did. <gasps> it's scary. Ah, uh, poor Kim. I'm sorry. That's not what happened at Nothing all. Nothing happened at all. That? It stays right there. Now I'm going to be good enough to twist it around so you can see that the hot is on the top. Oh, mm -hmm. nice. And the cold is on the bottom. This is exactly what we would expect to happen. The cold stays on the bottom uh -huh. and the warm stays on the top. So hot air rises. Rises. Right? right. So hot air rises. Now we've got the opposite going here. Now okay. you can kind of start thinking through this. Now, Kim, what do thank you. Think you. Now's the inversion. It's gonna I'm happen. sorry. All right. I was so like, which is go. hot, which is cold? I forgot well, completely. It's easy to kind of hide behind the term. So watch what now happens we go. here. Would you look at this? We get what's called convection currents. I'll get my hand out of the way so you can really see what's going on. This is gorgeous. Look at this. You can actually see if you get right in here, see where the blue is starting to fall? Yeah. So look at the blue falling down here. The blue is falling. It's mixing with the yellow. The yellow is working its way, it's way up. up. And so you see this wonderful uh, convection, right? Mm -hmm. This is what you want um, in our atmosphere. You really, if you're driving your car, you want the pollution that comes out of the car, the carbon monoxide it's right. being created and, and uh, other things that are there. You want it mixing in the atmosphere and going way up way into up the atmosphere. What you don't want is the this colder uh, uh, weather down here, so the colder temperatures here being trapped, trapped by warmer air that's above. So what does this all mean with daylight savings? One of the things that people are talking about is how important it is to drive your car when the sun is out. So ah. think about it. If the sun is hitting the earth, you get this going on. The hot cold. air rises, right? right? Pretty warm. simple science. Right. But hot air rises, takes those gases, and you get this beautiful kind of convection that's there. That's what you want. If you don't have that happen, then you get this here, and that's exactly where you see the brown cloud with the yellow sitting on the top and the blue on the bottom. Notice that there's no mixing, even though there's nothing in between there. There's no mixing because that warmer layer is trapping in all of the pollution that would be in this lower mm -hmm. layer really kind of a, a very, very cool science demonstration. That is. It's perfect. I can see now, it can now. We, can we warn okay. the parents right now and be able to tell them that this is not a science fair project? This is a great no. example of a demonstration. But you have thousands on the Facebook page well, th and on stevespangler.com. stevespanglerscience.com. Yeah, Steve absolutely. stevespanglerscience.com and on your Facebook page, about a thousand. Uh, you know, and there's a lot of people that interact with all of that. So I okay. really liked with that. Okay. It's a pretty good science idea. Time. Okay. And here's the problem. You're going right. to need to get these down. Me. Okay. No. Oh, you take it down. I'm not going. I got to go. Here, right? We'll be right back. Okay. I'm out of here. Good luck with that, Steve. Have fun. No, no, it's all yours.